one and liftoff of Space Shuttle Atlantis. Atlantis made its ascent into space September 9th. The orbiter and the STS-115 crew, commanded by Brent Jett, arrived at the station on September 11th. With them came the P3-P4 integrated truss segment and its solar arrays, which crew members prepared for operation in three successful spacewalks. The 17-and-a-half-ton structure will provide power and data services for the station. Its solar arrays will double the station's power generation capability. It was a pretty tough few days for us, uh, a lot of hard work, a great team effort to get the station assembly off, uh, restarted on a, good, on a good note. After a 49-hour journey beginning at the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan, the Soyuz TMA-9 spacecraft carrying the Expedition 14 crew of Commander Michael Lopez Alegria and Flight Engineer Mikhail Turin and American space participant Anishay Ansari docked at the International Space Station. We have contact. A little more than three hours later, they were welcomed aboard the station by Expedition 13 Commander Pavel Vinogradov, NASA flight engineer Jeff Williams, and European Space Agency astronaut Tomas Reiter.